everybody. Welcome back. Jiu Jitsu 2000 here today. I'm back with a quick unboxing video. I just got this package in the mail today from Chris from Four Directions Bushcraft. I'm really excited about this. Him and I decided that we would exchange uh, packages. I haven't got his together yet. He beat me to it. I've been super busy, but I'm working on getting him a package together as well. So I'm really excited. Let's take a look and see what we have inside here. Now, I've got this thing upside down, so I have no idea what's in here. I'm going to make sure that I untwist this, make sure there's nothing tucked inside, because sometimes people tuck things inside there. I don't see nothing there. Ooh, I smell fat wood or something. Ooh, I can smell it. it smells interesting. Take a look. Wow, what is this? Oh wow, there's a big old piece of fatwood. Check that out. That is cool. That's good fatwood. You can just smell the pitch in that stuff. Smells good. Wow. That is cool. Thank you, Chris. What is this? This looks like a ferro rod or something. This is, hope I didn't get off camera there, folks. Sorry. Wow, look at that. I love the carabiners. Check that out, fourdirectionsbushcraft.com. So if you guys don't know Chris, go check him out. This is super cool. It's a 5 16th diameter ferro rod on a big, healthy piece of fat wood. That is super cool. Look at the lanyard work that they did. So you not only do you have a, a carabiner, but you have some fat wood and you have a ferro rod and you also have cordage. So if for some reason this ferro rod didn't work or you couldn't get it to go, which I don't know why you couldn't, but you could use that cordage probably for a bow drill set. I, that's super cool. What a gift. It feels like Christmas. This is crazy. I'm not used to getting goodies like this from, from good friends. Now this, to be honest with you folks, I don't know what that is. Looks like, I'm not sure. I might have to uh, read the note and see what that is. Now what do we got here? FourDirectionsBushcraft.com These little bags, these are cool. What do we got in here? Uh, that's some sort of cha uh, some sort of uh, chaga maybe. That's cool. So this is good for flint and steel fires. Check that out. I bet you that's you know charred a little bit, so you could probably throw a spark on that very well. That's cool. Thank you, man. I'm just I'm just blown away. You know, it's pretty cool. I, I love gifts, <laughs> and you know more than that, I, I love exchanging gifts back and forth. I think that's super cool. So here's another little package. Let's find out what we got in here. I'm getting ready to go check out his, his page because I want to make a an order. So it's something. Is this birch? There's a container. Wow, it's got jute. And I'm guessing that's birch bark. I, I don't know because... I don't have birch in my neck of the woods and I know that he said something about he would send some birch or something so so that's cool the way he packaged this it's got jute I don't know honestly if I should be untang uh, if I should be unwrapping this right now maybe it's something that I was supposed to put in my pack and use it when I needed it so I'm, I'm guessing that's some sort of birch bark this thing is heavy. Whatever's in here is heavy. It has a significant weight to it. So check that out. There's a big tinder bundle. Okay. One of his fire starters. I'm feeling like wax. This is cool. Just infused. I'm going to smell it real quick. Smells like regular pine pitch or some sort of pitch from a wood so not only do you have a nice tin check that out look at how easy that could take a spark 
Gosh, all kinds of fire. I like that, Chris. That is super cool. I love the way it went into this little package, too. So you've got, I'm, whatever this material is, I'm guessing it's birch, but you've got the jute. That is such a cool uh, package, the way they put these together. Super neat. I can't fold him like he can, I'll tell you that. <laughs> he's talented. He's He's got this figured out. He's made them before. Uh, that's funny. I can try. You know, I, I love it when the YouTube community can get together and, and share, you know, with each other because, you know, it's just, it's, it's just cool. There's no community on earth in my opinion that's that's like the YouTube community it's just it's amazing it's a brotherhood if you will super cool I don't know if I'm gonna be able to fit that back in there this is super cool you know this this whole YouTube brotherhood thing is is, is, is too cool you know I was watching his video where he did uh, several of his videos for that matter and other people's videos where he did the uh, contest with the fire kit that was cool that was cool the way they put that together and the way he sent that out to all these other people to put things in this kit that was super cool I loved the idea the concept behind it it was cool and that was a prime example of, of what I'm talking about right now about about the YouTube community getting together on things I think that's cool wow that is neat now I have one more big package here I like these bags. These are nice little bags. Og bunny. I'm thinking these are cotton. So these bags alone, I mean, I'm seeing all kinds of uses out of this stuff. I'm going to set this box aside real quick. There is a letter there. So I'm, I'm seeing a lot of things here. I'm seeing cordage that's cotton cordage that could be used maybe for some sort of wick for candles or, or oil lamps or something. Then I'm seeing this cotton material that he uses for his bags. You could use that to make char, char cloth. Wow, this is birch bark. I'm excited. I know some of you are like, what's the big deal about that? But it, me, I live in Arizona and I, I've never seen anything like this. We don't have, in my neck of the woods anyway, we don't have birch trees. So, wow, this is super cool. This is just packed full of birch bark. That is cool. That is super cool. <laughs> I've heard this stuff is good fire starter, and this is so cool of Chris to send this to me, because now I get to play with it, you know, in my neck of the woods, and, and and see how, you know, what everybody's been talking about, about this birch bark. That is super cool. You know, and the thing that, that I really like about these exchanges is not about the money a person spends on you. It's about what kind of time and effort that they put into it. You know, it's not about the money with me. It's about It's about the fact that he went out and he 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 you know put this kit together just specific for me I'm, I'm just so so humbled you know it's so good to have friends like that that can you know give and you know take back and forth you know we can scratch each other's back so to speak super cool now I'm gonna check out this this letter so if you guys haven't seen Fort Directions Bushcraft check him out Chris here's his phone number here's his website He's got some cool products. I've checked out his, his website before. It's really cool. Looks like a sticker or something. Pretty cool. Good stuff. And a letter. Fatwood Fire Still. Wow. Four directions bushcraft.com. Included items. Fire, fire Fatwood Fire Still. It's a ferro rod mounted on a premium piece of fatwood. 550 paracord lanyard and four directions.com carabiner. These are all handcrafted and have their own unique look. These one-of-a-kind ferro rods come in two different sizes. The medium measures 4 inch by 5 16th and the large is 5 by 1 half. So I got the medium. That's pretty cool, man. That is so cool. These are designed to be an all-in-one fire with fatwood handle that's large enough for many fires. So that that is super cool. You can just scrape some of that fatwood off. He gave me a little bit of extra fatwood. Just super cool. I love this. I'm reading the letter and it says that these are wax rounds are very powerful small tenders, uh, tenders 
that will not fail you in any condition. If you're ever in a situation where everything is soaking wet, including you, and you need a fire immediately, these are your go-to fire starters. They're small, but powerful fire starters can burn for approximately 15 minutes each due to the reduced paper recipe. With that amount of burn time, they can dry out tinder, wood, and you. They're sold in packs of five or ten. So he gave me a pack of five of these. I'm just so excited. I can't wait to get a package together for Chris. So cool. You know, it's just it's just super cool to have friends again. Chris, I want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart. This this stuff means a lot to me. It really does. I just love, you know, being able to give back and forth and, you know, watch each other grow and help each other on their on our giveaways that we're doing and get other people to go look at each other's channels and go check out your website and stuff like that. That's what this thing's about with me. So again, folks, I want to say thanks for watching. I hope you guys got some good information. Go check out Chris. Go check out 4directionsbushcraft.com. And check out his YouTube channel. He's got some cool stuff. He did a YouTube video uh, just recently, a bow and drill set. And he wore shorts, and it was snowing outside. It was really cold. Well, it wasn't actually coming down. But that video was cool. Uh, and I appreciate it probably more than most viewers because I am a fellow... Uh, bow drill guy and I know the difficulties that come in making friction fire and so I was able to appreciate that video you know knowing how difficult that task is so again thanks for watching everybody have a beautiful day we'll see you next time